The motion, sponsored by members representing the affected constituencies, aims to find a lasting solution to the devastating effects of flooding and erosion in the regions. The House also notes that NEMA conducted a disaster risk management analysis and advised ministries, departments and agencies around stand to move my motion on the call to combat the perennial flooding and ravaging gully erosion in the Kina local government area of Kogi State. The House notes that the Dikira local government is a major political, educational, and social economic nerve center in Kogi State, which has joined four other local governments like Basa, Ofu, Omala, and Nangpa, respectively, and serves as a gateway and transit route from Omala and Basa local government areas. Also notes, Mr. Speaker, that the incessant business of flooding and erosion in the Kina local government has been a long-standing and nagging issue that has plagued the Kina local government for over a decade, thus causing loss of lives and property and affected the social economic activities of the people. The worst hit areas are Ayuba, Iyale, Odu, and the Kina towns. Worry that as rainy season intensify, flooding and gully erosion would escalate due to inadequate drainages, poor urban planning, and climate change impact, requiring urgent intervention as resolved, Mr. Speaker. One, urge the federal government to A, urgently establish an interagency task force comprising of representatives from the Ministry of Environment, Water Resources, Works and Housing, National Emergency uh, Management Agency to coordinate efforts and execute comprehensive flood and erosion management strategies. The dredging of River Benue is expected to reduce the risks of flooding while also improving the livelihoods of residents in the affected areas. That the River Benue is one of the two major rivers in Nigeria, a tributary to into River Niger, stretching approximately 1,400 kilometers and a vital transportation route, water resources for irrigation, drinking and domestic use, supporting agriculture. The move is a significant step towards addressing the long-standing environmental challenges facing the two states. Residents and stakeholders are eagerly awaiting the implementation of the motion, which is expected to bring much-needed relief to the affected communities. From the National Assembly, Kadwin Amundi, Rapid Television News.